You say that investors should put their money anywhere but tech. You trying to ruin me or something? I came here to shock you this morning, Stuart. That was my goal. Um, no, look, I mean, tech is the most overconcentrated trade right now. That's where most investors have their money. Valuations aren't cheap. We've talked about this a lot. Yep. Um, and you look like Apple last week, a little bit of bad news, lost $200 billion in two days. So it's kind of like it's standing on stilts. And meanwhile, the rest of the market, I would argue, is relatively cheap. Well, what, what, what do you mean the rest of the money? If I don't put money into tech, where do I put it? Okay, so my philosophy is income is king. I have 60% of my clients are baby boomers, one of the fastest growing wealth management firms in the country. And if you look at it right now, like any dividend aristocrat, companies that have raised their dividend for over 20 years plus, their earnings were actually going up last quarter while the overall market's earnings were going down and the valuations are a lot cheaper. So anywhere where you have a nice dividend and dividends are increasing consistently, is a great place to allocate capital right now. We know growth stocks and tech stops pay very, very little dividends. So right now, it's a perfect time to reallocate your portfolio to where the dividends are a lot richer. If I'm going for a dividend-paying stock, yes. I want better than 5%. Because I can get 5% in a six-month treasury or a one-year treasury. I've got to do better than that if I go to a corporate corporation. You're, you're playing right into my thesis this morning. <laughs> Cash is trash. And I'll tell you why. Whoa. Here's your biggest risk. And this, investors always make the wrong decision at the wrong time. It sounds so smart to put your money in a 5% treasury. The problem is inflation's coming down. Next year's an election year. I'm pretty confident the Fed's probably going to start to lower interest rates. So all of a sudden, that 5% you locked into for a year, that money market fund you're getting 5%, all of a sudden it's paying 3 Meanwhile, you missed a move in the market because earnings are going up. It's a great time to invest in stocks. And you could have locked into longer-term bonds at a 16-year high in interest rates. So buy a longer-term bond portfolio, lock into the market right now. But to sit in cash is like the worst decision you can make with your longer-term money. No tech, no cash, high dividend payment. That's where you go. You heard it here first, Stuart. And that's your company. Pain Capital Management, P-A-Y-N-E. That's my last name. I got it. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. Good Thanks, to Stuart. see you again. All right. Pity what you said about that, about technology. But we'll forgive you this one. All right. <laughs>